Right. So I bought myself a little present. Something to play with while mummy's watching Coronation Square Farm. Got a calcium carbide lamp. So that would have gone on the front of a bike. We're going to see if we can get it working. This is about 1928, this one, I believe. Um, so it's quite old, isn't it? Yeah. We'll see, see if we can get it working. Right, so we've put... We've managed to find on the interweb a new burner. So we've got that in. The reflector's cleaned up nicely. So we can close that down. Close the lens up for now. And we can, do you want to undo the bottom bit? Right, so I don't think we'll use them little bits in there. Right, so what we do, we get some calcium carbide, which looks like that. Get some calcium carbide, put that in there, and then in the top of this, we twist that round, that opens two little holes up. You fill that with water, and then as you twist that, that opens up that little pin there, and water will then drip out onto the calcium carbide and do you know what gas it creates when they mix together? Uh, no, that's Acetylene. Uh, yeah, like what they use in welding. Oxacetylene, which is oxygen and acetylene. But when the, the water drips on the calcium carbide, that will make um, acetylene, three-part gas. Um, and then when that mixes with air, that will come through through the pipe, up through the burner, and light, and hopefully it'll work. Just gonna put, just in case there's a gasket on there, just in case that's not very good, just gonna put a little bit of Vaseline around there, just, just in case it doesn't seal properly, because otherwise the acetylene will come out, and, uh, and it'll all, It'll catch light outside the lamp instead of inside the lamp. We don't really want that to happen, do we? Mm. It smells horrible. It smells horrible. Well, it will smell um, sulfur, sort of eggy when it starts making the gas. That's what the gas smells like. So, tip a bit of calcium carbide in there. Is it on? Or is there? Right, that'll do for now. Right, so we've done the water valve up, we've opened up the top, put some water in there. I think when I unscrew this, the water starts dripping out the out of there. Let's screw that back up again. So we know that works. Right, let's put it together. Right. Let's pop that together. Nice and tight so it doesn't leak. Make sure that's done up. That's just that just comes off so we can blow it out and clean it out. Right. Let's get a light up. Right, so we're gonna Does the cat need to be away? Well the cat might go woof. Come on, then you pop. Alright, go that way. Right then. So I'll undo this. Can you hear it hissing? Mm -hmm. Oh, it stopped then. It just blew bubble. It sounded like, um, oh, it's on there. It sounded like Daddy's belly. There it goes again. <coughs> so that's making gas. It would take sort of 20 seconds to build up a bit of gas. Oh, there it goes. <coughs> well, it's lit. There we go. There was a little bit of leak around the bottom. So uh, turn it up a bit more. Give it a little shake to get it. Turn it up a little bit more, get a bit more water. Oh, that's pretty cool. There we go. Around your eyes. And you can hear it. Every now and then it goes. 
pop does a little pop of the cough. There he goes again. Come away. There we go. So now it's actually quite bright. If I turn the light off, oh, yeah. don't be shiny. How bright that is. There we go. It's not quite like an LED, but you can hear it popping and right. It's on the on the side. The really old ones had a. Green lens one side and the red lens the other side, like port and starboard. Um, but then they soon realised that having a red light at the front um, could be a bit confusing. So the, the slightly later ones had a green one either side. There you go. Oh, it's nice and warm as well. So there we go. It actually worked, first time. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Well, we've turned it off, we've taken the bottom off, and what does that smell like? Smell it, smell it. Oh, oh that smells like, that's, that smells like Saturday morning pops up, doesn't it? That absolutely stinks.